And number four, that is it, Bradley Costello and Carl Costello in the Sophie. As the horses here make their way up to the back of the mobile stand, about to let them go here in the home stretch, 2,080 metres ahead of them. As they make their way up, as the green light is switched on, the core and the horse is not up on the gate there, as the arms fall back and the green light is switched on and you're away. And then as if you can't cross the like driven from the outside there, shows good early game speed to grab hold of the forward marking position here in the open trial this morning at Cranbourne. 2,080 metres ahead of them. And that is it, is steered to the lead. So that is it on top of the quartet as he makes his way down the back here. So that is it on top. We see by some uh, 15 metres early on. Casino Barry settling in the second position and third is Sandy Snuffle. And Cora Moore drops out to be the last of four. As that opening margin starts to uh, narrow just a little bit there, that is it. Very keen, wants to go forward here out on front of Parker. So I leads the field by about uh, 12, 15 metres, second to his casino Barry, Sandy Slunker in third, and Cora Moore at the tail of the field. As they start to climb their way off the back of the circuit, so back to near where they started. That is it on top here, the son of sports rider in the black and yellow colours charges forward, leads here by some 15, 20 metres, two second, it's casino Barry, the uh, golden there by Hessen Blue Ship USA in the second position. In third, Sandy Slunker, sparkling with a little bit and last of all, Cora Moore, the daughter of Julius Caesar in there. So into the home straight, back to where it began. And that is it here. In a bowl position out in front, there's the bell. That is it, takes him down to the bell lap, down towards the judge, with another circuit to go. That is it, looks to be comfortably, uh, comfortably travelling here out in front. Just give him one there with the cane here from Carl Costello. This is, that is it, he's soldering on out in front by some 25 metres. Still, Casino Barry in the second position with Sandy Spike in third. That is it at the tail of the field. Down to the 800 metre marker they go, and that is it. No change in the order. Is he comfortable leader or right? He's out in front by some of the next 20 metres. That is it out in front. Casino Barry still in the second position with Sandy Spike in third. And Cora Moore, but no change in the order at the tail of the field here. So, just given another couple of cuts here with the uh, whip there just to uh, keep his mind on the job, as that is it. Soldiers on out in front, leads here comfortably too. The uh, leading margin looks to be narrowing just a little bit there as Casino Barry is hurrying along. Now, Cora Moore charges on from the back of the field, uh, now into uh, third position, and last of all is Sandy Sparkle. So the four of them make their way off the back of the circuit here, back to the Decron home bank, with about 220 metres to travel. That is it on top of the event. In second, it's Casino Barry. Cora Moore rooms up over on the outside, and in third, yeah, fourth, there is Sandy Sparkle. Into the home straight, that is it uh, in search of the line here for Carl Costello, out in front by some 15 metres, still Casino Barry in the second. But that is it will take out the opening trial here this morning and he's up over line by about a good 12 metres. Second was Casino Barry in third there was Cora Moore and Sandy Sparkle wants to read the judge. So that is it an all the way victory for the opening trial here this morning over 2,080 metres. We'll get the times and margins from the judges.